Welcome to 5-Minute German Grammar. Thank you for watching. This presentation will introduce accusative prepositions. In English, a prepositional phrase is a group of words that functions either as an adjective or an adverb in a sentence. That is to say, it could modify either a noun or a verb. At its most basic level, a prepositional phrase consists of a preposition and the object of the preposition. Here the object of the preposition is a simple noun phrase, the forest, although the object could contain other modifiers. Since this prepositional phrase, through the forest, modifies the manner in which the subject goes, it functions as an adverb in the sentence. German also has prepositions, which are classified as being either accusative, dative, or two-way, either accusative or dative. The preposition you see on the screen, durch, is an accusative preposition meaning through. Ich gehe durch den Wald. I go through the forest. And like English, the preposition also has an object, which here is again a simple noun phrase. You will notice, however, that the object of the preposition is in the accusative case. This brings us to an important rule about accusative prepositions. Any noun that is the object of the preposition must be in the accusative case. Here, once I make der Wald, which is in the nominative case, the object of the accusative preposition, the masculine definite article must be changed into its accusative form to show that it is the object of the preposition. Furthermore, everything inside of the prepositional phrase, between the preposition and its object, must also be in the accusative case. We could, for example, insert more adjectives into the phrase. Ich gehe durch einen dunklen alten Wald. I go through a dark old forest. And they would all take accusative endings. There are, of course, some important exceptions to this rule, but this is an advanced grammar topic that I will cover in a later presentation. For the time being, simply think of everything in an accusative prepositional phrase as being in the accusative case. There are seven accusative prepositions in German. Bis, by, until, to, durch, by, through, entlang, down, along, für, for, gegen, against, for, ohne, without, and um, around, for, at a point in time. Some of these seem to have the same definition in English, but in actuality, there are slight differences in meaning that need to be examined in greater detail. Since this examination will take a bit of time, I will do this in a later presentation. The five-minute German grammar series is produced by David Neville, Associate Professor of German. The video scripts and lecture slides are released under a Creative Commons attribution, non-commercial, share-alike 4.0 international license. Don't be a square, remix and share.